all right folks and welcome back to another video so i recently encountered an issue when making another video and i realized that i was getting audio issues on mobile devices specifically android devices and i was uh doing a lot of research looking into it and trying to figure out a way that would be able to correct this audio issue not just for me but for other content creators and to make a video about it so you may think that you're getting these audio issues because of your editor because of your asp or because of youtube itself but that's not the case the reason why you're getting this is because of a cable like this a female xlr to 3.5 millimeter jack cable and it's the way in which the audio is recorded into the dslr so folks as i previously mentioned the audio problems that have arose is down to the female xlr to 3.5 millimeter jack lead uh, connecting from your lavalier mic to your dslr camera so i'm here in sony vegas now and i have a little uh, video track uh, which is a part of a video i previously did the player unknowns uh, battlegrounds game test using the graphics tablet and i've put a background track uh, down at the bottom here uh, just for reference a background music track now normally when you import it into your editor um the audio source it will uh, take both channels into the audio so what this means is that when you're recording your voice with the lavalier mic it's being recorded in uh, stereo format so you can see there's two of the same track here on this one audio track over here now sometimes when you play this back in the editor you play back a certain section of it uh, sometimes you'll hear nothing sometimes you'll hear like the subjects are underwater currently at the moment uh, the sound is actually fine here but uh, as I mentioned previously when I rendered out the video and uploaded it to YouTube I noticed that there was a big problem with the audio for this particular part of the video so I'm just going to play this back and let you hear exactly what it sounds like So you can hear that uh, my voice is coming out clear and so is the background track. Now sometimes this is not the case as I said, sometimes you can hear that the subject's underwater or you'll be able to hear the background noise from the track and you won't hear the subject. So when I click on the uh, track it should look somewhat like this. The video and the audio for this particular video source is combined. So what i'm going to do is i'm going to ungroup the two tracks so if you press ctrl and u in sony vegas uh i'm just uh, going to let you know this should work in any editor so it should work in final cut and it should work in premiere pro as well so now that we've uh, ungrouped the audio and the video together if we click the audio track and we right click it and go to channels it says the option is uh both now if we press combine and play back the same section we're going to hear a difference so with the combine option we can hear that we can't actually hear my voice in that video track at all and sometimes that's what you will actually hear when the option is put in the uh, both format by default in your editor so what i'm going to show you the best way to correct this in the editor is to go to channels and have it as left or right only where your voice is uh being mono as opposed to stereo now i'm just going to show you a little trick here so if we uh have the voice set to right only now if we create another audio track and put the audio track beside the audio above what we can do in order to give the uh, impression that the track is stereo is we can copy the audio track above and put it below and put them together and if we click one of the tracks we can have my voice panned hard left so 100% left ear and then for the uh, 
duplicate track down below we can pan it hard right and that will give us the impression that it's stereo and if we play back the same section again back then, we video. should be able so to hear my voice be looking at what it's like the game on a graphics tablet now this is the Huion 8610 Pro that I recently got for the educational series on the channel so folks uh, I hope you like that little fix. There is uh, a couple of reasons as to why this happens. Uh, there is actually an electronics uh, explanation to it, which I'll put the link in the description below. But from the production end of things for content creators, I think this is probably the quickest and most effective way in order to sort out the audio on cellular devices so I actually encountered this problem in a previous video of mine a few months back which was the Audio-Technica Pro 70 review and it was in a particular section of the video where I'm using the lavalier mic and a battery to power the phantom power for it down in the West Link Bridge in Belfast and I had people uh, saying to me that they thought that the sound was pretty messed up on uh, mobile devices and I didn't have a fix for it at that time so i hope that this little fix in uh, sony vegas which should be the same for premiere pro and final cut that uh, it'll help all you content creators out there and hopefully not trip you up and uh, help you get your good audio content out there to the world